Hi guys, welcome back to Coffee Morning Love. That is your girl Shields and Michelle. Hey. So we're uh, back here. Yeah, I know people have been listening in thinking, where's them two people, man? Who is where's them two people? And then I've been like, oh, they're gonna come back, they're gonna come back, yeah. And guess what we did? We brought them back. Shell, let them know who's in the house. Yeah, so we have our can I call him our resident male? Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> right. He's only that introduction, yeah. <laughs> our resident Mal. We've got the lovely Victor, and we've got the people's favorite. The people's favorite. <laughs> the people's champ. I'm not gonna say that word. Yeah. Yeah. Please don't. The people's champ. I'm leaving it there. It's our mate Bola. Yeah, yeah. everyone. Oh, and to Bola, welcome. I should have said it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. I'm somebody's yeah. auntie, it's fine. Yeah. Well, you look, you look lovely today, but I can't thank lie. You, on this hot, you. hot day, you're coming looking a bit like a spice. You got a date today? No, I wish I did, though. Yeah. But, uh, uh, but you uh, never know, plans can change after midnight. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know what, yeah, one of my friends, um, husband, used to say to us whenever we used to try to go, to go out, he used to say, Nothing good happens outside after midnight. <laughs> what are you girls doing out there? <laughs> so whenever, we, whenever somebody says we're going out after midnight, I'm like, nothing good happens after midnight. <laughs> yeah. But so what we got for today? So for today's topic, we will be talking about is having too many options impacting on people's ability to settle down? Yeah. Yeah. We couldn't do a. Um, a relationship one without having these two in the house here because again guys nothing has changed since the last time this group came together <laughs> yeah. 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 wow yeah. Yeah. Michelle, Michelle, yeah, for good for Michelle. Michelle is still the only person in the team here that is actually settled down happily happily, yeah. mm-hmm. happily married happily. yeah maybe i'm gonna try white now because it's last thing <laughs> 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 Uh, oh, that's Jazz, Murray White, Murray White. Yeah. And now, uh, but, uh, you know, prayer points are still going still ahead. Still prayer points. Yeah. These lot are not praying hard enough. Yeah. And, uh, Victor, I know Victor's been in the streets, in and out. Yo, yeah. no, 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 wait, wait, wait. Victor, Victor, let Victor no, it I'm telling you lot now, yeah, Victor parked the car for a hot minute, yeah. <laughs> then, oh. then the next week, it was somebody else. Whoa, no, 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 wait, 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 listen, listen, listen. Whoa, whoa, Guys, whoa, whoa. if you believe that you believe anything, Victor, 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 do not okay. listen to Sheila, Victor, do not listen Victor, to me. Yeah. Me, I'm just a pillar of the community. Victor. I'm at home, chilling. Victor, Victor, let's be real. Yeah. Wow, wow. <laughs> yeah, that was with my boys, isn't it? But Victor, yeah. <laughs> Didn't I not see you? Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did, did, did cool. <laughs> yeah. Did, did you see what I Where saw? Did you see? <laughs> I, I came in a black car and left in a white one. That's what I saw Victor doing. Yeah. Listen, uh. but literally, that is that, that is the relationship. This is the relationship podcast. Yeah, it, we're not the relationship podcast, but it's a podcast on relationships today. So, Victor, in your own words, what is stopping you from settling down? Is it too many options? God said it's not my time yet. Hey, good <laughs> answer. <laughs> what was your own name? The same as Victor. <laughs> When God says it's time, <laughs> yeah, that's no, it. Because I, I actually, I actually believe the fact that you know people are not settling. We've had we've had a couple of conversations here before yeah. around about like you know people using dating apps, yeah. people being introduced to people. Yeah. But is it the fact that there's too many options? That could be a part of it though, I reckon, yeah, I because agree. obviously you could be talking to what five, six, seven women on the go. Yeah. And then it's hard, it kind of clouds your judgment. On who it is that right. you need to be with. Who you want to yeah. connect with. Because somebody actually might do something that might vex you and you're like, you know what, yeah, I don't like that. So you well, move on to the Well, that's the thing next. though, but this, this is my issue. Yeah. I yeah. honestly believe that we, all, honestly, nowadays, we operate in a microwave dating environment. 100%. Like, literally, like here today, gone tomorrow. Like, yeah. yeah. Like, the amount of times, say for example, if I see someone who I know, I'll be like, okay, I'll see this person with this person. Two, three weeks later, there was another one. I was like, okay. This is there what it is. Two, another one. I was like, okay. Yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah. What's going yeah. on here? You know what, yeah. Richard, you know what you're saying is true, you know? Because mm. that's like when I saw you, a different person. No, no listen, no, 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 no. Guys, guys, guys. No, 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 no. Listen, 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 listen yeah. Do you want to tell us more about this? No, no, no. I don't know what she does talking about, yeah. Richard's on the way. She came, listen, I came unprepared. I've been. No, no, no. It's a setup. It's been bamboozled. It's a setup. Can I just put it this way? Yeah. Rita, I didn't pick the subject. You 
you pick the subject? What? Oh, hey, I, I was just again. I'm just looking at the <laughs> so community trying to help incident? people. Can there was no incident. There was no incident. Can I share? There was no incident. We I went out. Yeah. We told somebody, and I said, I really like this you person. You saw me with who? I, I'm not, I, I can't remember her name. No names. You yeah. saw me with who? I can't remember the name because it was like changing faces of it. Oh, oh wow. Yeah. Wow. Oh. No, listen. <laughs> listen. Do you know what, yeah? Can, can I say something? Guys, <laughs> guys, again, if you believe this, you believe anything. I believe anything. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Tell me more. Do you know what? No, we need more men on this podcast because <laughs> I'm been outnumbered three to one. <laughs> Bola. I know you're... Bola. Help, listen, you're, you're the voice of reason. Sheila, yeah. tell us more. Okay, I'll tell the story, yeah. What's so, the No, because I'm just trying to get to the point of, is it too many options, yeah? Because I'm just thinking, there's that time, remember that time, we had the house party? I don't know what to say. And I like, <laughs> I like that one, I like that one. And I said, I really like that one. And then there's someone thinking, where's that one that I like? Oh, no. And then yeah. that one wasn't there anymore. Yeah, but Then I come to the party, though, and then, it, so is it, that you've got options, you think there's something else out there that's better. I'm just, no, no, okay, no, no, no. <clears throat> yeah, I'm just trying no, to no, understand. No, 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 see, 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 okay, that situation you're referring to. Yeah. No, it was only I don't one... really like to. That's nice. <laughs> 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 no, but do you know what? I was only seeing, well, listen, I'm not one of these people who, I, okay, in my younger years, like, yeah. my 20s, I was a little bit more promiscuous, isn't it? And I'm. Nelly Furtado's song comes to I mind. I would probably say that, yeah, I, I used to. I would be one of those people when I'm not in a relationship, yeah, I would have quite a few options. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Which but, is only fair. Yeah, which is fine, which is fine. Listen, that's, that, and that's normal. Like, that's what everyone did, that's what everyone does. But again, again, I can only speak for myself. But obviously, the one thing you realize is that those, when you have too many options, it just makes you, it distracts you from the go at hand yeah do you know what I mean? yeah and Definitely. sometimes again if it, just like he said earlier if someone just annoys you for one second you're like, yeah I'm this person, I've got, like, yeah I'm with someone else yeah. but really and truly that's not the way to look at it yeah and i don't think it's a personally i don't think it's a healthy way to look at it because i'm just thinking the generation that we're in now not not i'm not seeing weddings anymore and we're at the age now where okay what, fake Nigerian weddings no we're seeing weddings oh. but Is we're seeing a lot weddings? more divorces in the weddings you know though no, 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 no. and I think that's people. happening a lot more I, I separations think, and divorces i think what you're saying is true and i'm going to come on to that b because is it i guess the link that i'm trying to make is it that our generation now that got married say 10 years ago or whatever when we were the generation that's getting married now yeah. they're divorcing yeah. yeah i'm seeing more weddings okay you've got younger sisters even yeah. they're not even that young anymore your yeah. sisters yeah but it will be like my little cousin Mill's age. It's now the 24 year olds that are getting married now. Yeah. But our age that are not married, it's like everyone's extra picky. Yeah. 100%. Everyone's like, no. Yeah, that's because people are But I do think social media a has boy. a part to play with that as well. Because if you look at it now, you've got shows like Love Island. People are coming in there, choosing a partner, moving on to the next. Yeah. And then yeah. people are practicing yeah. that in their day to day life. life. Yeah. That's what happens in a dating scene. Yeah. Have yeah. a little kiss here and there, doesn't work out. Crack on. That's it. Exactly. Weren't we doing this though when we were younger? I think when you were younger, on. Were, why I you. Was cracking on. I, I, not that I was out here, out here. I was a little bit out here. But I was <laughs> in a little life. But I remember going out to clubs like Ministry of Sound and maybe cameos. Come on. And I would give out my number to like four or five guys on a night. Mm-hmm. talking to them as and when yeah. and then it kind of filtered down and whoever made yeah, the yeah. cut made the cut so what's the difference i think when you were younger though i don't know for you but for me i just felt like it's more of a social thing when you're younger and whatever comes of it comes of it a chirping thing was just a normal thing yeah. Yeah. oh some yeah. guys were just yeah. chirp just for yeah. numbers but they weren't really pursuing you like that yeah. Yeah. and then the same for some girls it was like it is what it is but before yeah. you know we're all friends we all know each other yeah, yeah, yeah. i knew back in the day that one chirps me do you see yeah. what i'm trying to say yeah. but i think now people are actually looking for a partner but it's just unfortunate that they're not making the cut do you understand? Why are they not you, the because, because there's too many options, and there's too many guys out there that are out there to play games, and there's too many women out there that are out there to play okay. games. So it depends on yeah. what the goal is and what you're looking for. Okay, I, I see it two ways. Yeah, social media has made people more connected than ever before. Yeah, mm-hmm. do you know what I mean? So now it's easier to have Should more it be options. Easy? Yeah, do you know what I mean? No, 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 not 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 today. But also at the same time, I would say people within our age group. I think a lot of people being past traumas into new relationships yeah 100%. i strongly believe that i see that all the time yeah. i've seen it with myself yeah do you know what i mean i'm no different to other people so sometimes you have to understand that 
you know, when you come into a new situation, try your best to give someone the benefit of the doubt. But the issue is, is that once you've done that before in the past, a few times, well, a few times before in the past, you think like, no, what, I've seen this before. I know where this is heading. Before you know it, you've cut the situation cut without on. giving the opportunity to even, even breathe. And I think as well, yeah, the generation now, they're not seeing, I feel like the old school generation, they hid a lot of things in marriage. But I feel yeah. like we're the generation that we see everything. Or they, yeah. And we're it's seeing not even it. That they hid, they accepted uh, and Right. But that's what I'm saying. Because yeah. some things were hidden, we get into it, we see it too early, and we want out. But we don't realize that this was part of the journey, this was part of the struggle. So it's only when you sit down with the elderly and they'll tell you, listen, we've gone through this. You're like, really? Wow. But these ones don't want to go through that. Yeah. It's almost like, nah, can't handle that. You ain't got a job, nah, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> no, but impatient. Where it's like, your dad didn't have a job for three years. I had to ride it, but we made it work. Now he's the breadwinner. We yeah. don't have that patience yeah. anymore. Yeah. It was almost like, no, sorry, bills to pay. I'm giving you three more months. <laughs> <laughs> and then it's done. No, but that's yeah, the generation we're in. Not, we're not having that patience true. anymore. And it's almost like, look, divorce him. It's been a year. <laughs> no, it yes. no, it happens. Yes. My head, my head. <laughs> it happens. Well, yeah. <laughs> no, it happens. It happens. So I think that's what it is. And I think so many people with good morals and good standards are mixing in with the ones that don't. And yeah, they cloud their true. judgment that's into true. what's right and what's to settle for. But if you know who you are, you know what your goals are and what your standards are. And I yeah. think that's what is messing up a lot of relationships. I could get into a relationship now with a guy and I could think we're on the same page. Along the way, you'll find that he's not really on what you were on. He's wasted my time. I don't want to commit to this any longer. I'm out. Some people want to stay in it because they've really committed. They still want to go for the long goal. But when you do that, so many other issues come in. And it's, it's about what do you do to... <laughs> Yeah, like you're not old, yeah. I'm in between right now, aren't I? <laughs> <laughs> obviously, there's men out there that are your age as well, yeah. So it's like if we've all gone past, have we not gone past the, the playing game stage? Like, don't we all want the same thing? But it depends because everybody's after different things, and like I said, it's about being like minded. And if you're getting advice from people that don't have the same mindset as you already, that already clouds you. Because you might feel like this is my standard. Someone else is going to say to you, oh, no, you're being too fussy. You're being this. Just stick with him. That's what you will stick for. I won't. But after a while, you think, maybe I am fussy. Maybe I am this. And before you know it, slowly, slowly, you're letting your guard down because of how people see you. And I think that's what happens in a lot of relationships as well. Before you but know it, you're settling for things. That, it, that could be, it could be compromised yeah, as but, well. And I think the reason why people are single, possibly longer in our, in, on our side of things, because you're, you're settled in your ways. Yeah. The, the, the older you get, yeah. the more you know. Like they say, you can't teach an old dog's an old dog new tricks, mm. or you can't. You know, you can't now start reshaping the tree. Mm. It's got roots. It's rooted. Yeah. Mm. You don't like being woken up at certain times. You don't. You don't like certain things. Yeah. yeah? So when you meet somebody now and they're not doing the things you like, you're like, I don't need this bull crap. Yeah. yeah. I don't need the headache. Yeah. I don't yeah. want it. So you move on to the next thing. That's it. Yeah? Hoping that the next thing will meet your needs. Mm. Yeah. Cuts speak for everybody. I can speak for myself and say it's like I don't want to deal with that. Yeah. And maybe it's a lazy like what you're saying, yeah. The generation that we are, it's like I can't be bothered to deal with yeah. it. I'm comfortable with myself. I do a lot of things for myself. Now do I need a boy to now to come and start and just to touch is that having too many options? Wait, just to touch yeah, on that. Yeah, because there's always something else that could maybe it's the thought. It's an illusion of thinking See, yeah, there's something else. Exactly. There's something out there that's not out there. Like yeah. But just to touch on that as well, though, I did have a friend. Yeah. Obviously, I'm not going to say the name. What's I her did name? have a friend. <laughs> <laughs> so it's a have, safe space. It's so I did have a friend. She's been with her partner for years. They're not married, but they have been together for years and they've gone through a lot together. And she's oh. done a lot of things outside of their relationship that he's not aware of. Yeah. yeah. Oh, and while they were still together? While they're still together. Okay, go but girl. The thing about it is, I, like, there's been so many times where she's felt like she wants to leave the relationship. And I've yeah. always told her the grass is not greener on the other side. That's true. What you're willing, what you're willing to kind of give up, you'll find that you'll probably find that same problem in another person. But then you'll stick it out of him because it's like, oh, I broke up with this one. Let me just manage. Do you understand yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. So sometimes just work with what you have. But when you're with someone for so long, 
you're not used to the fact right you get too comfortable and you start thinking little things are a problem but yeah. ain't that because of the people that surround you as well because a lot of her friends are not with their partners yeah so you're getting advice from people that are single people that are dating people that want to date yeah. do you understand relationships yeah. that have gone left off, right yeah. Where yeah. her kind of left or right, this is it, and I think <laughs> her kind of, I think her support network needs to be more people that are in relationships that are dealing with similar situations. And how do you find the line between sticking it out and being unhappy? I think being unhappy, yeah, or just actually like cutting your losses and do you know what? But I think Let it depends. Do you know what it is? Yeah. I think it depends on what you want in the relationship. If whatever, whatever you're in, if it's a burden and the burden is not trying to change then you got to make your own decision. Do you know what I mean? It depends. No, but everybody's got their own. You're in a relationship now and you're happy. Things are good right now. God forbid if something she's happens... Marriage. She's in a marriage. Yeah. <laughs> she's in a marriage. She's not seeing how things are going. She's already there. Yeah. So God forbid, let's say a midlife crisis comes along the way with your partner. Yeah. And then, I don't know, you depend on him for a lot of stuff. Situations change. He gets the, you know, all these negatives start to happen. Yeah. And you've lived this way with him for, let's say, three years in. You might get tired of that. So you would have to decide, but are you holding on to the old person or are you going to be there and stick it through until... Yeah, but they're married though up. and they took No, 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 but that's what I'm saying. But some yeah, people yeah. divorce and just opt out because they, they're they not used to it. They can't deal with it because that's not I what they're used they to. They divorce somebody because they've gone through... A mental health situation 100%. or a change in their body it's just people will divorce people maybe so I, think I, I think a lot of people are separated my, though a, a friend's parents yeah they were together they had three kids and then he i think it ended up stroke or something like that at the end of brain injury okay yeah and she left and she, after about maybe four or five years yeah she she left five what years is good enough to, to go i think <laughs> <laughs> Wow. If you marry wow. Sheila, you got five years wow. after brain injury. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Is that wrong? That's what I'm saying. It depends on the person. Some people intend, because everybody's commitment into marriage is so different. If my vision and your vision is no matter what, we will never divorce. That is our goal. Then we're going to stick it out. But some people are like, look, if he's not doing what he's supposed to, I cut him. That's it. That's it. I was like, oh, so that's it now. You've proposed. There's no way out. Like, you want to look? Yeah, I said, yeah, you You're locked now. in. Like, you're locked in. Whatever Go move it. Like, you're locked in. And I think looking back now, we, we talked about it before, and yeah. I think, okay, maybe that was a little bit um, out of order. Yeah. However, yeah. I, he knows I believe in the same thing. Yeah, you, yeah you've always said, yeah. yeah. I just know that it's going to take a lot for it to break. To be like, yeah. You know what? Yeah. yeah. I don't mean I don't, I don't want to take the piss because dad, this is not that cool. Yeah. But it will take a lot for me to be like, you know what? Yeah. But then what about on his part? Because that's for you though. But would it take a lot for him? Oh yeah, because you, you know have what I mean. Value, does he yeah, have the same yeah. Value and you? that's what I'm saying. You guys need to be on the same page with the same goal. It could be like we could go. You through know what I mean? You don't have to be on the same page because if he wanted out, what am I gonna do? No, no, no but that's true. Like, no, I get what that. No, I get that part. Versus. But what I'm saying is these are reasons why people are breaking up because mm. the the goal is not always the same. You've got your standard. He's also gonna bring his own. And Michelle, you know sometimes. Them people then wake up and want to change their minds about life. Shit, lah. <laughs> 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 I'm shaking my head, but I know she's right. <laughs> <laughs> just, uh, I'm, just, I'm, just not, I'm just not happy anymore. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Don't love me. 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 Yeah, I'm going to Turkey. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. Can I think things through? <laughs> and, then, and then you sit on the beach with someone, <laughs> some, someone blonde. So, so hold on. So question, question, question. Yeah. yeah. So, Sheila. Oh. Yeah. When you're dating, the are you the type of person to date multiple people at Which? the same time? Or That's not a question. I'm really getting questions on this podcast related. Yeah. <laughs> it's the like... people want to know. The streets want to know. The streets want to know. <laughs> Victor, you want to know? You can text me privately. <laughs> We have not received an answer. Oh yeah, answer. All right, cool. Yeah, do I date more? Yeah, I date multiple people. Okay, I okay. do. Okay, do and you how do let, I do, do it? You, do you tell them that I'm? I'm <laughs> Why are you starting? Do they know that it's not my hair today? <laughs> 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 do they know that before I came to the 
came to meet them, yeah, I didn't even have eyelashes on. Wow. <laughs> no. Do I let them know? Do you know what? If somebody is bugging me, I'll be like, you're not the only person on the roaster. Oh. Oof. 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 And Oof. it's just like, because you remember, yeah, people sometimes become entitled, yeah. But like, you know this because you're still in a boat, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You left the jungle, yeah. Like you left it. Trust me, yeah. But like, we're still making our way Come through. Come on now, we're trying. Yeah? We're going for we're the crack. Yeah? You know, some guys want to be messaging you. Did it? Did it? I'm not on. doing anything. Mm -hmm. You're like, oh, what are you doing? Just Again, taking up, space. taking up space, yeah. So sometimes I've got to let you know that you know what, yeah. You're not the only person here. Come on. So I'm like, look, I'll make it. Cause I'm like, yeah, I'm going out tonight. I'm a single girl. Da -da 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 -da, so I'm going out. If you don't like it, there's nothing about it. Come on. Okay, okay. Okay, all right, all right. Beyonce so, okay. said it first. Uh, yeah. uh, okay. <laughs> no, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, so in saying that, so okay, cool. So you say you're the type of person when you're dated, you um If I like you, I won't tell you that I'm dating other people. But hold on, but what I need to understand, so what I would like to know is okay, how many is too many though? How many is too many? Mm. Well, my aunt Lillian said to me. <laughs> yeah. yeah, Aunt Lillian. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. My aunt Lillian said to me, you'll be a mug to date just two. Or three. Ooh, okay. So but can, I, can I say something in this as well? I think dating is easy. I think if you've got an interest in somebody yeah. you're dating, you're likely to focus on, on that, that, dot, yeah. that interest. So can, I, can I come to that, though, yeah. in saying that? Mm. But my, if I'm, because obviously with work and like life that happens, yeah, and I've got a social life as well, yeah, mm. sometimes it's hard for me to be dating loads of people. Yeah. yeah. So I just, I, want, I don't yeah. have the time to do it, yeah. Mm. But it doesn't mean I'm not. So if you're now lacking in this week, Come on now. I might be like, you've you know gone, yeah. gone back to week one, Going back to. Yeah. 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 Because, you've gone to tears. Wow. Tear, there's tears, right. isn't it? Yeah, there's tears. Because remember, yeah, it, my social capacity can only take so much. Yeah. yeah. So each week, I might only have time for maybe two dates. Yeah. Okay. One dinner and one breakfast, brunchy one. Okay. okay. So if you can't fit yourself in, if I can't fit you into the two, yeah, on the two. One, yeah, <laughs> the world has gone round. Yeah. See you next month. <laughs> Unless I really like you, and now I'm making yeah, yeah, I'm making more time here. But to, for me to like you, you've got to be present. So you can't I'll be just like it. you can't just be messaging so me. So how long does it take you to like someone then? How present are you? So and you, how you often say you see them like once a week. No, like if you're consistent, it's like a converse. You know how it is when you're having that relationship with somebody, yeah. even a friend. It's like that consistency of yeah. how's your day going, my day's good. I'm investing into you. I remember, yeah, with a new relationship, yeah. It's not like we're old friends. Because I don't have to talk to you every yeah. day for me and you to be cool. Well, I could just be like, she was just happening next week, yeah? And we won't even talk for the whole two weeks until yeah. the thing happens. Yeah. I'm like, I'll be, you're still going to come and get me. Or when we're meeting. But if somebody is now trying to chat me uh -huh. or trying to talk to me, bro, I don't even know you. Yeah. Yeah, you can't be messaging me. Yeah, if you're doing that to girls, you better stop. Yo, listen, yeah. listen. And my mum always. You're not listening to Shuri, yeah? She's you're trying doing... to get me for yeah. this whole pod, yeah? And my mum always, yeah, if a guy really likes you, he will make the effort. 100%. And I feel like guys that don't make effort, they're not into you. Yeah. There's no in between about yeah. it. Like, it's black oh, no, and white. 100%. Listen, I think, I, I listen, think, listen, I think from... guys will make an effort, but they need a reason to make an effort. I but don't know yeah, about the, I think What's the reason? Opinion, did, 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 Remember did, that thing you that Because mean? you're not going to make an effort just for any, any No, 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 no you. But what I'm saying is You have is, to be able to see Look at it like this Look at it like this, yeah Do you want Because you said guys will make an effort If they see something, yeah? Yeah what are you looking for? It depends on where you are in life, isn't it? Because, for example, with me, I'm the type of person I date. I date with intent. Of course. You know what I mean? So that's I'm... why he's called you back. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just listen, saying. Guys, listen, guys, listen, 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 what is going on here? Lisa, can I just say what something? What is going on here? Lisa, can you exactly? Lisa, can I just say something? Yeah. Let's just ask you a question. Let me just ask you something. Yeah. So we've always done a few a couple of podcasts here together. Yeah. yeah. So like, since we've been doing podcasting for the last coming up to two years now, isn't it? Yeah. 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 We've already been doing anniversary here. Wow. We haven't done your own anniversary. Wow. <laughs> yeah. So we need to come yeah. and celebrate. So, so Victor, yeah. Wow. What's going on here? Yeah? So what I'm trying to really say is, yeah, <laughs> if you're dating with intent, yeah. <laughs> so for the last two years, yeah. nothing has been intentionally working. Wow. That's you sound like an auntie putting pressure on <laughs> me. Wow. I'm putting pressure because we're like, No, no, no. 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 No,
<laughs> no, I mean, listen. Listen. No, no but you know what it is. No, but just thing, but just because I can date with ten doesn't mean the other person's gonna date with ten. That's true. It takes, you, it takes two to tango. No? That's true. It's true. We're tangoing. We yeah. are. We but are. I want to say this though. When you like a girl, you know sometimes you can like a girl. I don't know how it's for a guy actually, yeah. but I'm just saying when you like somebody, so I don't know what it is about this person I like. Then we connect, we talk. Yeah. Do you understand what I'm coming from? Yeah. So that is there first. So that's gonna keep your interest going along yeah. the way. If you start to pick up that they're not really about what they are, you yeah, might yeah. start mm. to drift away from mm. that. Which but what I'm saying 100%. is, if you do like somebody, you are gonna be more persistent. Yeah, and it yeah, means, yeah. you know what I mean? And like, I what are you doing that, today? Hit you up, yeah. I was doing this, let me come by. Drop and, and that even, I think that you know even what I mean? helps the relationship to move forward. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. But cause, you know, plan something. Exactly, it, yeah. yeah. Cause like, I said this to you before, before Michelle, innit? How I got with my ex. Mm. Cause every week before I left the date, there was another thing sitting. So why is he your ex? Exactly. Or to all my Jurian men out there, don't date shills. <laughs> Thank you very much. You've heard I it on the mic. I appreciate you. I want to bring. I'm already back. <laughs> <laughs> so oh, anyway, like I she didn't leave. leave. No, but the reason why it worked out, you know, why I got with him, was because of the consistency. Yeah. Yeah. Obviously, after that, after a little while, six months, you set to see yeah. this person for me. Da, 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 yeah. da. Life happens, yeah. But it would have never happened. It was consistency on both sides, yes. Yeah, I was turning up. Turning. Wow. But were you but, instigating? <laughs> you see. I was. No, this I is the easy. What, what do you want to see more? Of? Proactive, be proactive. What's what does that proactive look listen, like? Listen, do you know what it is? Everybody wants to eat, but no one's willing to cook. Hey. You understand? So you're All basically the, the your issue is you're not finding a woman that cook. No, 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 no. no, no. It's the no. Na- na- analogy we're trying to. Oh, sorry, guys. There is an, there is an analogy <laughs> for us. <laughs> I need to, I need to develop. This is a new oh, analogy. This English has become something else. <laughs> I know no, some of you no, listeners because agree. Again, it's like, listen, for me, it's a case of, I, I'm a true believer. I that agree with that. I'm a true believer in that a guy initially should be intentful in terms of being proactive, in terms of yeah. making dates happen. Yeah. You know, you can be creative. It doesn't have to be then you know the, yeah the I, I was doing you things can, as well do you know what i mean you, you, you can mix it up do you know yeah, what i mean yeah. no once we got into it i was doing things exactly but the thing is is that after a while you don't want to feel as if like from a guy's perspective you don't want to feel like you're being used yeah do you know what i mean you want it's just it's just showing initiative that's all okay i'm not asking for much it's just saying okay say for example i've planned the first three four five dates yeah all right Maybe do something, yeah. At some point, I agree do with something. you. Like, I do, but, do you, but do you ask, like, oh, Actually, you know, to, yeah, no, 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 no. Yeah, but what I'm saying is, yeah, you're saying that, but some people, remember, everybody's different. Mm. If you've gone with somebody that where you're quite impulsive, on the next relationship, you might want to be a bit more calmer mm-hmm. mm. because everybody's telling you how to be. Mm-hmm. Do you see what I'm saying? But no, 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 but sometimes it but can play a part too, is, though. I would understand if I have you, to ask. If we're young, I would get it. But when you're at these ages, I, I don't know, no, man. Well, I, I don't hear you, but well, I don't know. Ages. I feel that's like, like people, people say... always telling you how to be. You're too loud. You're too dish. You're too. So then it's like, when do you keep it calm? Mm-hmm. No, but the thing you is, know, but if you like, because if you like someone, wouldn't you no. want to do? Okay, let me say something to you, yeah. Let me see. Let me say something to you, yeah. This is actually I'm a true a, story, I'm yeah. And I'm sorry if you know who you are when you listen. I'm sorry in advance. I'm sorry. I have to say it. I love these disclaimers because. Alright, go on. Do I know them? Very well. Oh, okay, tell them. Yeah, you know. <laughs> yeah, listen up. So my thing is, yeah, <laughs> there's some people that I know, they will date somebody mm. and their their um their way of really liking somebody is taking it to the next level really early. That's yeah. the way they express getting physical. Right, yeah. how they like. But to me, you need to slow that down because yeah. you're giving that too early. It spoils the relationship. Yeah. It's not a Let's do now and yeah. question later. Yeah. Question. Mm. But everybody's got their own love language of how they accept mm. what I'm is what. I'm glad you mentioned love language. So the point mm. I'm trying to make to you is I hear what you're not saying that, oh, but at this age, but you would think so, but not everybody's on. No, 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 but hold on. Hey, but I'm yeah. saying, No, 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 <laughs> but if she says, well, I like the person a lot, that's what I'm going to do. And you're being advised to do. It's like you have to get to that place for yourself. So what if the, well, I want to take things slow, then that's fine. But. I just think everybody's at different 
levels. I, it's the I mentality. Still agree, the yeah, understanding. Yeah, I still, I still make the statement of. At the age that we're at now, Victor, you was right when you. I think Victor was right when yeah. he said, after four dates or five dates, you should be able to say, you know what? I thought we can do this yeah. as a female, or if the person's taking you out all the time, just like somebody's paying for things all the time. Yeah. yeah? Sometimes you now plan. Exactly. I, or it's sometimes not hard. Like you now it's plan. Not hard. Yeah, that, yeah. It's yeah. not hard. It's I, not hard. I do think back to your point, though, Bola. Yeah. That example. I think if you want to sleep with someone on the first date. That's, I don't think that says much. I don't think that says much because I just know situations where people have with people the first day, they've gone on to have families. A, families. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's what I said. Is. That's fine. But what I'm saying is if that's your regular, I like you all the time, how much mileage are you trying to carry with you on your journey? As many mileage as they want. <laughs> They've got a German <laughs> whip. <laughs> as many mileage as they want. But the point They've is... They've got a German whip. Like no. You're shaming. You're sex shaming. I'm not shaming. Yeah. What I'm trying Bola. to say to you is, if Bola. you're doing too much and you're wondering Bola. why it's not happening, Bola. maybe it's an advice. Bola. Just maybe slow maybe. down in that area. Maybe. If you've got a German whip, <laughs> keep going. Yeah. <laughs> Shilla su- supports you if you're listening. <laughs> If you're in the German, everyone's different, guys. Yeah, because I'm very bad. Yeah. It's, it's too hot in this room. Yeah. I'm no longer making sense. Yeah. No, I, I, I'm not supporting it. Yeah, if you're gonna get down on the first date, that's up to you, Victor. Have you had one of them ones? So, good weather today. No I just think that, um, no, I don't know. I just think, I don't know if that's, I, I just think that, you know, I hear it all the time about people, oh, and you said your love language. Yeah, you know, that's important. Love language, they are very physical. Yeah. I'm quite tactile, yeah. but I'm not, um, I'm not, yeah, I'm, I'm I don't want to say too much, but I'm just saying, yeah. What are you in? What's your, what are you love languages? What's your love language? But Victor? you know what? What's your, Sheila asked you? Mine. Oh, go on there. Um, Let's help people out there that have been dating. Oh, gosh. <laughs> <laughs> um, what? Acts of service. So, what are the last acts of service? Come on. Acts of so services. Gives, yeah, this is good. Affirm- words affirmation? My words, words of affirmation. affirmation. Really? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Lovely. My, f- my first top one is... Let her finish what oh, they are. Oh, sorry, what you just listening. Oh, my bad. She's just listening. Sorry, listeners. Yeah. So there's affirmations, yeah. saying, saying yeah. Um, acts of service, yeah. so like doing things for... Yeah. Um, the That's yours. Child, which is like the hugs, the kisses. Yeah. Which physical one's touch. Physical, oh, physical touch. touch. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Physical touch. And what else is there? I think that's it. Gift, give, you give, 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 give. There's four. There's also given there's four. There's five, yeah. Um, oh yeah, there's um, words of affirmation, yeah. Google's physical coming. touch, yeah. um, gifting, yeah, gifts, yeah. Wow, listeners, you see, you see. Wow, yeah, listeners, you see people that have been telling you advice, yeah. <laughs> like, this, is, this, is why, this is why people are single in this room, yeah. Because there's a little bit of a five-level language. Right, yeah. so, so, five, there's actually five. Yeah. Yeah. Words of affirmation, yeah. Yeah. acts of service, mm. receiving gifts. Oh, yeah, uh-huh. quality time. There we go. And physical time. Yeah, quality time then. Yeah. Um, quality time. I don't need your time, I, man. Just give me a hug. You want a hug? I like physical time. I like people to hold my hand. I like people to put their arm around me. Really? Give me a hug. Sheila's yeah. is definitely gift giving. Oh, gift giving. Oh, thank you. Yes. Receiving gifts. Receiving gifts. Exactly. Receiving what? Gifts. Yes. Yes. No, yes. yes. Listeners. Listen. Receiving <laughs> gifts. <laughs> words of affirmation. <laughs> exactly. No, that's what you know. Receiving <laughs> gifts. <laughs> words of affirmation and quality time. That's yes. Shillers. What? Receiving gifts. Words of affirmation. And quality time. That's Shillers. <laughs> 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 I think she likes. Do you like to be told you look good? Of course she does. Who doesn't like to be told? She ain't I, gonna make that effort to dress up, and you don't, no one's making one happy. comment. <laughs> no, I don't mind. I, I like my clothes, my clothes. I don't, I don't. You know, I don't care about. It. Yeah, yeah, I don't. Like it. I, don't yeah. I don't care. But if you don't like it, I love it. That's yeah, it. if you don't like it, I. You know why I would have said that though? Only because you know she could be fussy with gifts. If you give her crap gifts. Yeah. I don't like your gifts. <laughs> so for the fact that you don't like it. Well, isn't that you, Bola, with your DVD? No, I'm alright. Yeah, no, 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 no,
That's what she was saying. That's what I'm no. But yeah, you, that's what. You, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, but you know what I mean though. Thank you. No, you know what I mean. You know what I mean though. This level. Like I don't care. Level. Like this is what I'm saying. Even if it's not about the quality of something, sometimes yeah, yeah. just just the thought of it. You could have yeah. handmade it. You know what I mean. Yeah. But I just like the fact that wow, well, it's something that I would like. You know what I mean. Yeah. It could have been something. Oh, acts of service. Yeah, hundred percent. No, it's mm. nothing just that. Do you know what it is? But the I, thing is, why I saw your calendar people, out. No, no, no. Do you know what it is? I would never ask something of someone that I'm not willing to do myself. Yeah. For yeah. them. Mm. Do you know what I mean? So for me, I think access. For mine is my access service. I think access well. service. Yeah, yeah, I know. Brothers is access service. Yeah. Quality like time. Quality. Mine is access service. Quality time. And what was the other one? Receiving gifts, where's the information? Like yeah, but I feel like yeah, that's not for me. That's not a demand for me. It's normal. Yeah. It's just like if you do it, you do it. If you don't, I'm not gonna feel like oh, you haven't given my touch today. <laughs> wait, wait, hold on. Oh, wait, wait, hold <laughs> yeah, on. No, so are you telling me? So if you're out and you're with your guy, yeah, and he's not holding your hand, and he doesn't hold your hand, or he doesn't even hug you or anything that's like literally so yeah, but you it's not feel something, type of way. I will be alright. It's not <laughs> something. Cool. Let me, no, let me but, but he now sees his nah. female friend. No, no, you're missing it. You're missing it. What I'm saying <laughs> I'm is that comes you, yeah. No, let me tell you, that comes normal in a relationship. No, it doesn't. From well, the relationship I've been in, it's normal. So I've never looked at it as a demand for something that yeah. I need. Do you know what I mean? Maybe mm. if I didn't have that, yeah. I'd have been thinking, oh I miss a little touch here and there. <laughs> but I've never experienced that because to me okay. that's what happens in a normal relationship. No, it's not because no. so you, you had to tell Dan. I, had to I know tell this Dan. Dan. I had to tell Dan. Like, he'd just be walking along and I'm like, Are you not going to hold my arm? Like, oh, I've never had yeah. that, so I can't relate. No, yeah, really? but, but, yeah. But, 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 maybe when it's been taken away, then I'll be yeah. like, Oh, I get what you mean now. Okay. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm, I think I'm quality time. Yeah, I'm quality time. Yeah. And, um, but you're so time. busy, you don't have time. Though. But that's but why it's quality. Make time because okay. it's quality. Okay. That's why it's quality, wow. yeah. Yeah. Okay, okay, yeah. Okay, 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 okay. I would not even get my English to play Because <laughs> <laughs> as soon as I said that, I'm going to say something because I don't even make sense. But uh, yeah, I, I think I'm more of quality time. Because remember, I like to be with people. Like, if I'm spending time with you, I'm spending time with you. Um, gifting. Yeah, give me a little gift in it. Why should I try in it? Yeah. No, g- she loves, loves a gift. She, 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 she will tell you my birthday, my <laughs> my Christmas day, <laughs> everything. That's the ten. That's the ten. No, but if you're gonna get me a gift, if, make if it no nice. one gave her a gift on her birthday, this girl's gonna feel it. Not I'm, one person. Mm, no, nah, I wouldn't feel it. Shall. But you would hold it against you, would you? Oh, I don't. I'll send you the text. <laughs> Last year, <laughs> just like flipping. Yeah. No, I wouldn't hold it against. Do you know what? Yeah. Mm. Oh, the person that I'm with. We know. We know. We know. We know. We know. We know. <laughs> the person that I'm with. Yeah. Truth has come out. But I've never, got, I've never got rid of a person, and I haven't got like good gifting. Because they know you. Michelle, you need to up your gifts though. Oh, yeah. you see, you see, you see. Because I'm coming out. Yeah. But Sheila, it doesn't matter, remember. But it doesn't matter, Sheila. Mm. You, said it doesn't you just said it doesn't matter. No, no. They no. heard your name. Um, no, no. What I'm going to say is, yeah, oh it, wouldn't, if it wouldn't bother me like so much. But if I haven't seen. Okay. As long as it's not Coach Carter, I'll, you're all right. Yeah. <laughs> I'll give you this one. <laughs> Coach Carter. I don't want to go over that, yeah. But, okay, so it's, it's a thing of like birthday shout outs. Yeah. Okay. If I haven't spoken to you on your birthday, okay. and then I'll go and do shout out on Instagram or whatever, what's the point? Okay. Nah, yeah. 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 I, I, what's the point? So that's like the yeah, same thing with a gift. Yeah. Amazing. If you haven't even said to me, she was, I'm going to schedule this time in to spend time with you for your birthday. Yeah. Okay. But you're just sending me a gift. Okay. It's not like you're not in the country. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's, I, it's it's like yeah. you. I'd rather be with you, but come with the gift. Mm-hmm. It's like you're palming me off. Yeah. yeah. And I mean, like, I wouldn't do that to somebody. Like. Listen, Go on, go on, go on. Go on. Bring actually, back. Know, one question. What I want to ask, Michelle, you, you <laughs> being, being the sole, <laughs> sole individual who is here, who's married. Uh, so, make sure things will be different, guys. Yeah. <laughs> Michelle will be married by all of us <laughs> here. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, all of us here will also so be talking a different you, story. So, would you advise your single friends? Um, us here, your friends here, one, two, three. Those who are dating, would you advise, male or female, would you advise them to, okay, if would you advise them to keep their options open or just keep it solely with one individual, see where it goes, mm. then if it doesn't work out, then move on or would you advise them to, okay, um, date someone but keep your options open, so say you meet someone, on, say, you, say you go on a date on, mon- someone on a Monday, then maybe Wednesday you might meet someone else, would you advise them to give out the number? Time is running out. 
Come on, girl. Okay. <laughs> 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 no, no. Michelle knows. If she weren't married, she would be on what we're on. So she out. knows. Yeah, I think at this age and stage in our life, yeah. you know, there are some people that generally take the piss. And like, yeah. thank God you, Shills, she's only Shills dating life that I really know in this room. But I've seen some women really being taken advantage of. Yeah. yeah. In terms of finances, time, Come on. Yeah. their bodies, yeah. their acts of service. They're giving out so much. Yeah. And nothing's coming in. Yeah, 18 months. Yeah. yeah. And they put their all in. Okay, I'm just waiting for him. He's, he's, he's promised me this. He said this. Yeah. And then the wife comes along. Oh. Or yeah. the kids. Or yeah. Or even he just said, Or they get pregnant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And surprised. Michelle, is it, this sounds a bit personal. No, no, it's not me. I know. <laughs> <laughs> it's not me. It's one of her friends. Yeah, but one of yeah. One of my friends. Told you yeah, it happens. Yeah. It shouldn't be. Yeah. 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 That, yeah. That's that's eight yeah. months. That's a long after. That's a long. Come yeah, on now. Married with a kid. kid. This is eight months. Yeah. A lot can happen in a year. We got told yesterday. A lot. Come on. You got sold now. <laughs> she won't even. <laughs> Mola, it's true now. You got sold now. <laughs> Testimonies are they're real. They're real. This time last year. Yes, now. A, a lot can happen. Come on. A lot can happen. We are dying in this room. Oh, Lord, 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 Lord. <laughs> Lord. <laughs> Woo! Woo, oh, Charles. Lord, yeah. It's hot in this room. <laughs> it's hot in this room, yeah. We're going to have to cut the podcast here. <laughs> No, Mitzah, like last words, last words, yeah. <laughs> What's stopping you from being successful with somebody? I told you, it was all in God's, God's hands. God's timing. Time. <laughs> What's on you? He's not looking for me enough. Oh, ah, no, that's a good one, you know. I think my only last words are, I don't, I think there is such a thing as too many options. Yeah. But mm-hmm. maybe like two or three. Yeah. Like just try and focus on one, you know, your yeah. strongest candidate. And maybe just take a bit of time, yeah? Have a bit of patience. Nobody's perfect. Mm. Um, relationships are about compromise, yeah? Mm, so, 100%. You know, give them a couple of strikes. Maybe one, two, three strikes, yeah? Yeah. But just take the time. No oh, problem. so one more thing. Please, please, people, take accountability of your own actions. Mm-hmm. Okay. You not... Know your own part, the part yes. that you play. Yes, it's easy to play the blame game, better. but play, take accountability. And one last action. thing as well. These are for the <laughs> ladies, though. Take your time in choosing. There is no rush. No rush. Mm-hmm. Facts. Anybody else with one last thing? I have a good last week to say on that note, you heard it here. Coffee morning laughter. Victor Rambola, thank you so much for coming Thanks, in again. Guys. Thanks for you us. guys, you know what, yeah. This is home. This is your home. Keep coming. Keep loving the Coffee Morning Laughter brand. And um, take your time. <laughs> All together, one last words coffee morning laughter there you go